Hello everybody, welcome back to Juicy James Gaming, and I know, I've been gone for a long time. I've been gone for about four months. I hadn't really posted anything since October of last year, with my last like big video being a Gears of War 4 video. I kind of just decided to take a break for a little while, and but I'm back. I did post already post a video of me and my friend Jack from JRC Gaming playing for honor. And then, of course, there's my whole live streams of Resident Evil 7, which you should go check out because, yeah, let's face it, they're awesome. <laughs> but anyways, I've had some friends wanting me to record Tales of Berseria, which is the next installment of the Tales series, the last one being Tales of Zestiria. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. I'm probably not, which I really did like a lot. And then I played a little bit of this so far, and I really do like this one a lot as well. So I'm just going to give everybody maybe just a good glimpse into the game. If you want me to continue playing, just let me know down in the comments below. But anyways, I'm just going to go ahead and get right into the game. So let's get started. Alright, so we're already starting off in a freaking battle here. I just kicked that fucking wolf here. bitch ass. Let's hurry on. <laughs> Getting out of here comes first. Damn right. Alright. Anyways, guys, so basically we play as a character named Velvet. Now, Velvet went through some pretty crazy shit at the beginning of the game. And unfortunately, I cannot show you that because I'm already like two hours into the game. So essentially, right now, we are, are breaking sure? out of a prison this meant for demons. This way leads to the main entrance. If they know you're here, they'll have found your ship by now. The guards expect us at the rear, not the front. Yeah. So I'm pretty excited to show this game for y'all because I'm actually really am enjoying this game a lot. And it's actually really fun. I, I mean, I can't, I don't know what else to say. Like the combat's really cool. The story so far is actually really funny there. and cool. That's enough. Oh shit. It's the exorcists. Oscar, I had no idea an exorcist Praetor had been assigned to this island. You surprised me, Ceres. Aiding criminals now, are you? Did Lord Artorius request this? No. I'm acting on my own. A mullet with free will? And yet, I sense someone's strings guiding me. Hold on. A Praetor is far more dangerous than an orderly. I'm all out of subterfuge. And besides, if we can't overpower this one, our end goal was hopeless to begin with. You're a demon, but still a lady, so I'll show you due respect. I am Oscar Dragonia, Praetor of the Abbey of the Holy Midgand Empire. Who might you be? Huh. All right, graceless demon it is then. <laughs> All right, here we go, we're gonna fight this fucker. Let's kick his ass! Lord Artorius himself taught me the ways Come of the Come on! Come on! Wait out! Yeah, get knocked out, bitch! Oh shit, oh shit. Nope. I got rid of that fool. I can't, I can't lock onto this guy, unfortunately, which is pretty lame. All right. You are skilled. I will have to expend a Moloch or two for this. Oh shit. Let go of the lady. More of your vaunted reason. Oh shit. Man, Belva's a badass. No! Uh-oh. Something bad is happening to this guy. Oh no. With demon blight? That is not good. It's lost control. <laughs> yeah, I would say it has lost control there, buddy. 
Of course. She would sacrifice herself. God damn it. Samus. My wounds are fatal. Please. Consume me. I'm not about to. My form is bound by an oath whose price is my life. The time has come to pay. Feeding on my form will grant you strength. The strength to press forward. I ask only that you devour me. Why? A flame burns in my heart, too. A flame I cannot quench, no matter how hard I try. Just like you, Velvet. Oh, she brought the comb. This was Luffy's. That is why oh. I cannot abide it. This frozen world. This frozen people. I'm just... That stubborn of a woman. Hurry. Before my life fades. Do it now. Oh, shit. That's gotta suck. Oh, shit, we got a little, we got a little I anime no thing here. Okay, cool. thanks. I need neither. Our wishes. Aww. Are one and the same. <laughs> I treasured those days. <laughs> when you and I... <laughs> And Arthur were <laughs> together. Oh, this is too goddamn sad. <laughs> Holy shiitake mushrooms. Oh shit. What is happening? No. About to kick some ass. Don't. Let's do it. Come on, Velvet. We can do you. it. Uh, battle tutorial. Break souls. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Here I come. She absorbed that Malik's power to wield as her own? I've never seen such a demon. Bam! Bam! Take this dragon, bitch! Consume him! Bam! Dude, I'm just kicking ass right now. Holy crap. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Let me kick this dragon's ass. Come on, this dragon's almost dead. Oh, no, get away from me. Come on, oh yeah, this is it, this is it. Oh yeah, take this dragon, bitch! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Kick that dragon's ass. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Apologies, but I can't let a nasty demon like you roam freely now, can I? What a bitch. Velvet. That's my name. You can give Artorius my regards. My name is Velvet Crow, and I will devour demon, Moloch, and exorcist alike! I am a monster! I am a Therian! Oh my holy shit! Did not expect that one. Less risky if you hadn't suddenly appeared and jumped on my back. Oh, hey, it's you. It's thanks to you that Stormhowl is back in my care. Rokorodon gets it. At your service. This blade is my life. I owe you a great debt, one I vow to repay. Yes, yes, she's a peach and a model citizen. Can we get our move on? I think they're just about done massacring the rioters. The docks are just ahead. Give me a hand. <sighs> Guess the weather's feeling as crummy as I am. Careful. The sea's looking mighty choppy. Are you a sailor? No, but I do know the difference between a sail and a rudder. I'll take what I can get. Do what you can. You're leaving without a proper crew? Very well, then. I certainly owe you this much, at least. Brave words. <laughs> but ten minutes in this storm, and you'll lose all sense of direction. No, we won't. Ships have compasses for a reason. So it's rot in a jail cell, or rot in a fish tummy. Well, guess it's your lucky day, fishies! I'm coming for you, Artorius. Bye-bye! Bye, bitches! We out this hoe! Oh shit, we crashed. Luffy said... A Moloch? Ah! Stay back! Alright, let's kick... <laughs> Get owned. <laughs> that was easy. My word, a demon muncher. You really are a box of horrors, aren't you? Sorry. If I had a weapon, I would have helped. I promise. You, you do have a weapon. <laughs> you do have oh, a weapon. Nah, I can't use this. Sorry. Long story. And the child? The little brat? Scampered off somewhere. You ought to be scampering off yourselves. My debt is not yet repaid. Until it is, I will not leave your side. I can hardly...
easily scamper off without knowing from whence I'm scampering. We're lost, stranded, shipwreck survivors, no? <laughs> <sighs> oh my god. Well, then I expect this might come in handy. A map? Was that left by the child? Looks to me like we're in Northgand. Northgand? Then if we're to reach the capital in Midgand, we've no choice but to patch up our ship. What are your plans once you reach Logris? Something worth breaking out of prison for. Can't we stand around and chat somewhere nicer? Somewhere with soup to warm the body, tails to warm the heart? There's a city called Helavis nearby. I can't promise there much for conversation, but we'll find food in a ship right there. All right, cool beans. Sweet. I have no idea what the fuck that is. That, nope, nope. Okay. So essentially, we're on a quest for vengeance as we try to find the bastard that killed our brother, which is that Artorius, or she calls him Arthur. Well, now she calls him Artorius because she hates the, his living guts. Okay, anyways, like I was saying, essentially what happened was Arthur killed her brother, Lafayette, to... Essentially, she he stole his power to gain his way. Now he's, like, leader of, like, this exorcist-like thing in the capital and stuff like that. So, we're on our way to go kill his ass, which should be pretty interesting. I'm pretty excited to go to go through that. Um, so, anyways, but I'm going to leave it off here. Um, you all got to see a little bit of the story. You got to see a little bit of the combat. You got, you got, you saw a little bit of everything. So if you want me to continue with this, uh, this series or whatnot, just let me know down in the comments below. I more than likely will live stream this a couple times. Um, so hopefully I will be able to. If not, then, well, shit. <laughs> I also have a couple other games in the works to record. So, yeah. It, needless to say, I am back. I'm back and I'm ready to, uh give you all some dazzling content <laughs> but anyways that's gonna be all for me tonight guys and as always stay juicy motherfuckers peace out